Hey guys, so today's video is my December favorites. So these are my favorites from December. What I've been using a lot, what I've been reading, what I've been eating, and it's kind of cool. Kind of, because I'm not cool. The puns, if you know choice about it. I was just trying to be cool. So a lot of people have been doing this. This is probably going to be an early upload. Um, so, yeah, let's get into the video. So, the first thing I've been liking is Bethany Moda's perfume. Um, just Bethany Moda. It's her original perfume. And it smells like a tropical vacation. I've been wearing this a lot recently. Um, my only problem is that, like... My dad, who has at this is one good thing about it. Um, my dad has asthma, and he doesn't notice I'm wearing it, which is really good. I guess. So this is really good if you have like asthma, because it's not exactly that strong, but it can't be strong. Um, the next thing I like is also a perfume. And it's the Vanilla Bean Noel Noel. Uh, body body mist from bath and body works if you don't know what vanilla bean smells like it's like a vanilla a vanilla -y flavor and this is really good continuing on with the bath and body works theme another thing i've been liking is the vanilla bean noel nourishing hand cream uh, these are both the travel size ones because I didn't have enough money for the original one. And I got these in a vlog miss video. Check the vlog miss out. In a pear tree! My sister is singing this song. Um, so makeup -y stuff. No. Drop. I'm sorry. Um, makeup -y stuff. A thing I've really been liking is this CoverGirl Clean Oil Control Anti Mustance. This is suitable for sensitive skin and of course my skin's really really sensitive. So I decided to buy it and it has good oil control and everything and I actually found a foundation in my color. Um, I mean, look how close this is. This this actually looks lighter, like, in the bottle. And I, this was my, actually my first foundation. And I don't think I'll find a better foundation than this one. Um, this is actually my second bottle of it. I don't wear makeup a lot. I wear it, like, on special occasions. Um, I truly don't wear it a lot. Another thing I've been liking is um, these two LA color black book things. There's this um, smoky metallic one, which is like a smoky eye look, which is really cute. And the next one is a very neutral look. This one's called Neutral Chick. It looks like that. Um, I have my own eyeshadow brush that I can use, um, but I got these two from a Secret Santa, and I've been using the neutral one a lot. I not really like, I can wear dog makeup, but I've never like tried, so I just like this one. I got both of these from a Secret Santa, thank you! <laughs> um, the last makeup thing I've been liking is a red lip. <laughs> Can you be quiet? Is a red lip. Because red lips and rosy cheeks. Uh, this one got a little damaged because I've been using it a lot. I only, I don't wear much makeup when I go to school and stuff. This is um, a Rimmel London lipstick. It's very long lasting. I mean, this is in the Kate collection thing. Um, got this from Target. I mean... This is in the color 111 Kiss of Life. 
Another thing I've been liking is like just a nice cute Christmassy mug filled with hot chocolate or ice cream or something. And it's just really cute. Another thing I've been liking are painting my nails. These are my nails now. Sorry if they're a little crappy, but um, these are the two nail polishes I use, and I really, really like these. I would have gold nail polish on at all times. Um, this is a Sinful Colors one in the color Gold Metal, 1397. And I'll show you it. Wait, yeah, this is gold. And then this is the silver. This is by Sally Henson, Extreme Wear Nail Color. This is in the color 220 Celeb City. And these are both very good nail polishes. Um, this, the gold hasn't really worn off yet. Um, but the silver wears off a little, but not a lot. Something I've been eating, which sounds really weird, um, are these Altoid mints thing. They're amazing. Um, I've been liking these ever since I was born. I mean, these are really good. Another thing I've been eating are Kit Kats. This is actually one I got from my Secret Santa and I haven't opened it yet. So, thank you so much. I'm going to place them up here. Um, clothes I've been liking. I really like this sweater thing. It's like a sweater dress. And I like it. And it's cool. And I like it. And I'm going to wear it to see family. So I might as well like it. Stuff I've been wearing lately. Um, definitely a lot through the month of September. Is this blue sweater. <coughs> Can you not? Is this blue sweater. Th blue long sleeve sweater. The sweater is like tucked in. But this blue long sleeve sweater. And it has a hood. Um, my friend has this exact same one. I'm like, oh, I really like it. I might as well get it my own. So I begged my mom to buy it for me, and she did. And I was really happy. And I've worn it a lot in the month of December. Another thing I've been wearing a lot in the month of December are Uggs. These are p my pink Uggs. They look a little worn, because they are. I've had them for about a year. About two years now. And every two years I get new Uggs. Um, I just don't wear these out in the snow. That's because if I did, the snow would turn pink because of the dye thing. I'm looking for my phone! People. Another thing I've been liking is my... Stuff I've been reading, I guess, is my Disney book thing. If you haven't seen the photos of me at Disney, I made a whole video about it. So you should check, definitely check it out. Uh... There's, like, one photo of me with a character. Because usually I was, like, this, holding my hand, like this. Um. Because I, I would do that with every character, except for, like, two. Um. I'm in Girl Scouts. I didn't know if you knew that, but. I did do Girl Scouts. And the only photo. So, we I went with my Girl Scout troop. We spent... Here's the background story. After seven years of scouting, asking to go to Disney, we found Disney. We found Disney's Youth Education Series. My dog just walked in. So another thing. Uh, Stuff that I've been reading lately is my Disney book. I went to Disney. I'm a Girl Scout, so um, we, my troop leader, made this book for us. Um, so here's a little background story I'll read to you. Um, but if you want to pause this video, you can. I just want to make sure it's in the shelf. Okay. So I'm gonna read it to you. Or you could pause the video or something. After seven years of...
Scouts asking to go to Disney, we found Disney's Youth Education Series program. Yes, a STEM program. The troop selected animation history program. We would learn how Walt took his drawings and transformed them into movies. We also learned about Gertie the Dinosaur. The troop, I swear to God, dog, lay down. The troop fundraised for 18 months, hosting tea parties, car wash, holiday Christmas platters, holiday fairs, pancake breakfasts, selling Girl Scout cookies, and can drive raving over, raising over $5,000 towards their trip. Each month, each month we had a Disney planning meeting where we were selected, where we selected our hotel, planned meals, ate Disney snacks, Dole whips, and Mickey Rice Krispie treats. We planned what to pack, visited the airport, made our own autograph books and luggage tags. This Disney trip wasn't about going to Disney, but our scouts, but about the scouts breeding, building their leadership and confidence, as well as bonding, as well as bonding as a troop, supporting each other through this very advanced trip. We are so proud of them. To say we are proud of them is an understatement. We, these girls have skills to be true leaders in the future. Love you all. And it says my troop leaders' names. And so we have, like, photos of us selling cookies and stuff. And then we actually went to the airport we were going to. And we got to go on, like, the people mover thing. But, like, I don't know what to call them. But we went there. And sadly, one of my friends couldn't go to Disney because she couldn't raise enough money for herself and like me and my me and my other friend who are friends with her like we're like we should we can give you our spending money and she's like no you you just go I'm fine and like it was sad but we went to Art of Animation and it was it was really really fun it rained once I mean once that's it. Another thing, okay, besides Disney, because this isn't about Disney. Another thing I've been reading is Tyler Oakley's new book called Binge. It came out in October. <laughs> but I didn't get it until the beginning of December. So, because my sister read it and then I read it, so I just finished it while filming this. Exciting. So. One last makeup product I've been liking. I didn't realize that. It's lip balm. Definitely during Christmas you should wear lip balm. Because if you don't your lips will get really chapped and really sore. And it will just be a mess. This one I got from my friend Sabina. She's been in three of my videos. Three my birthday video Halloween vlog and one of my vlogmases she doesn't like being on camera either which it was really fun like getting her to film with me film with me so this is the end of the video I hope you like it please give this video a big thumbs up and I'll see you in my next video may the odds be over in your favor good